In this video, we will see how to search for text in Reaxis. Text may be a scientific topic, a substance, a reaction, a property, or combinations of the above. This video will just look at a scientific topic. Let's find information on the effect of antibiotics on gut microbiomes. The role of our gut microbiomes is a hot topic in research. It is estimated that about half of the cells in our bodies are microbiomes, and that most of them are in our intestines. For that reason, it's pretty important to understand the effect of any antibiotics we take. So here we have the home page in Reaxis, and you enter text and search Reaxis. I will enter antibiotics and gut microbiomes, and then click find. And here's our result list. In this case, three concepts have been detected. Antibiotics, gut, and microbiomes. All three are searched in the first set of documents. Other options include combinations of some of these concepts. Let's review the results. We see the list of documents in an order ranked by relevance. Components of the relevance ranking include the number of hits as a percentage of the total terms in the record, and relevant indexing, such as indexing of topics, substances, and reactions. We can click the down arrow next to Abstract and Index Terms to see the full record. From here, we can evaluate our results. These answers look pretty good, and we could immediately download them. However, it often helps to see the actual search that was performed. To see the search, we go back and click Edit in Query Builder for the set of interest. And this is what we see. In this case, Reaxis broke the query into four parts, in other words, into four separate querylets, and searched each part in the Document Basic Index. The Document Basic Index contains single terms in titles, abstracts, and index terms. Parts 1 and 2 were combined with the OR operator and were single terms and phrases for antibiotics. Note that quite a few alternative terms were added automatically to the search. Part 3 searched gut and alternative terms. Part 4 searched the singular and plural form of microbiomes. Many things have to be considered when building algorithms behind natural language search engines. Through Edit and Query Builder, we see the search, which we can easily modify, that is, narrow or broaden if needed. Let's see how to modify the search. I'm going to change the third box to include intestine as a search term. Note that if we click the down arrow on the left, we see a number of alternatives. If we choose Contains, then Reaxis automatically applies left and right truncation to the word stem. In this case, Contains, Intest, will of course search intestine and intestines, but also searches words such as intestinal and gastrointestinal. Let's also change the bottom box to include terms such as microbiomes and microbiota and so forth. By adding these terms, we are broadening our search. Now we click Search Documents and we obtain over 4,000 answers. That's over three times what we had before. So in other words, by adding a few more terms ourselves, we have a much more comprehensive answer set. Now we may wish to narrow the results. Let's add another box and see how many of the over 4,000 documents mentions bifidobacteria or bifidobacterium and so forth. We click Search Documents, and we get over 700 answers. In summary, to search text in Reaxis, just enter a few terms in Search Reaxis. Then look at the results list. Choose an option of interest and view the results. And if you'd like, you can see exactly what Reaxis did through Edit and Query Builder, where you can easily broaden or narrow the answers. Thank you for watching.